Southern Tier has seen new expansions of manufacturing just this week, with Siemens and Raymond opening new factories in the Southern Tier with the goal of reviving the booming innovation the Southern Tier was once home to. Today, Southern Tier officials met to talk about grant requests that will continue to revitalize the area. 12 News' Kyle Spizak visited the meeting to learn about potential projects. Earlier this week, businesses like Raymond and Siemens announced the opening of their new factories in the Southern Tier as the area moves towards what it once was. The Southern Tier Economic Development Council held a meeting this morning where they discussed the needs of the area such as workforce numbers and workforce housing and solutions on how to address them. We want to make sure our priorities match so that we're doing the best we can over our community needs, which right now is mostly about workforce development and housing. We've had a lot of success bringing in new businesses, lots of excitement about the battery industry and other industries we have, but we don't really need, have the workers that we need or places for them to live. So that, that's our biggest challenge. The council reviewed grants that were applied for by local companies and nonprofits and graded them based on their impact to their respective communities. Although the council doesn't guarantee funding, it's able to give requests a stronger push when being reviewed by the state. So what we do is we look at the grant applications, we actually score them, and then they go to the state, and the state looks at them as well. So the regional council, while we only have 20% of the vote for the application, we send a message that says we really believe that these, these projects that we send forward are very important. The Regional Economic Development Council is a fairly new group, but in the time that they have been meeting, members say progress has already been made. We're seeing large projects come in. We're learning how to really work well with, with our communities, with the federal government, with the state government, and it's really paying off for the Southern Tier. I'm Kyle Spizak, 12 News, Broome County.